This isn't as precarious as it looks. An intruder! Stop them! No, not... Uh, that's not helpful, you worthless pile of tin! How does anyone other than a house elf manage to get around in here? What was that? Accurate! Was that a golden stitch? Perhaps you should summon your wits and find out. <laughs> I hope that house elf can find us in here. Incendio! Careful, huh? Oh, there you are. Wait right there. Deed will come to you. <coughs> Hello. Ah, oh, Deek, we've been looking for you. Uh, apologies, Professor Weasley. Deek was looking through some of what's appeared in the room since Deek was last here. Is this the student? Indeed it is. Deek is honored to meet you. 
Deke has been a friend since I was a second year. We discovered this room together. I mentioned you to Deke. We believe that you might be able to benefit from this room like I did. Deke, would you be so kind? Of course, Professor Weasley. The Room of Requirement will always be equipped for the Seeker's needs. It's unplottable, so won't appear on any map. Most happen upon it by accident, if ever. Deep-seen students in need of an extra file for potions stumble upon the room filled with them. You seem to have accessed it in its form as the Room of Hidden Things. I was thinking about needing a place away from prying eyes. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, that explains it then. What I need specifically is a place where I can catch up on my schoolwork without distraction. Well then, the room can provide you with precisely that. Now, it's time to focus on what you need. Just close your eyes. Imagine the room precisely as you need it. The room will do the rest. yourself quite a canvas to work with. I look forward to seeing what you do with the space. Ah, and it seems the room has provided you with a desk of description. Excellent. It can identify unfamiliar items of clothing. One should always understand the effects of anything in which one is clothed. You'll find plenty of items of clothing that need to be identified. The desk will be an invaluable resource. I imagine the desk of description will come in handy. It will. I hope you'll take advantage of it. Now, I'll give you a brief lesson in conjuring. The room might not provide everything you need on its own. Conjuring? Yes, the magic of creating or conjuring objects. I'll teach you. Very good. When conjuring more complex objects, you'll need what's called a spellcraft. Spellcrafts are like recipes. They list the ingredients or resources needed to conjure a particular object. You should have acquired some for a potion station and potting table from tomes and scrolls in Hogsmeade. I did. Where can I find the resources I need? While resources such as Moonstone can be obtained throughout the Highlands, it's much safer and easier to purchase them. They can also be collected by vanishing objects in the room, such as the chairs you vanished earlier. In fact, you should have enough resources for now. I see. Can I regain resources by vanishing something I've already conjured? You can indeed. Hmm, quite perceptive. Why don't you give it a try? Go ahead and conjure the potion station and potting table. You should find both familiar since they'll resemble the ones you've already used to study magical plots and brew potions in class.
whenever you need to brew potions or grow plants. Presuming, of course, you've collected any seeds or potion ingredients you need in Hogsmeade or outside the castle grounds. Deke will be here to answer any questions you may have. Do not underestimate his insights. I will be sure to speak with Deke if I need anything. Thank you. Good luck. I shall linger a bit longer in case you'd like to learn another transfiguration spell for use in the room. I'm ready for the next lesson, Professor. Very well. First, you'll need to gather some moonstone. You can acquire it by vanishing items here in the Room of Requirement, or you can gather it carefully outside of the Hogwarts grounds. Return to me once you've gathered enough, and we shall begin the lesson. I have the Moonstone you requested, Professor. Good. Then we may begin your lesson. You can conjure more than potions and herbology tables. Conjuration can be used to decorate this space to your liking. Why don't you try it on the walls and floor? 